to start with cloud foundry we need to do two things first one we need to create an account in one of the cloud foundry instance so cloud foundry instance either we can install in aws or azure or gcp or we can use one cloud foundry instance provided by sap and we need to install a cf cli client in our local machine so first let's create our cloud foundry trial account in sap for that we we'll go to sap and create a get a free trial account click on that and agree individual users sign up for free trial and we need to provide our email id and other necessary details so let's provide those things oh i provide my email id my first name last name company let's give emisoft and india relationship let's choose consultant and give some password agreement and submit we need to provide the department also let's choose consultant uh, consulting submit so it will send a mail let me go to my email account and activate this one so here we activate our account account is activated and it will be automatically redirected and we need to close all the other tabs and click on start your trial and here we need to provide an mobile number so let me choose india and a mobile number and save and continue now i shall get an sms uh, with a code and this code i need to insert here and click on continue It will load our BTP cockpit. It will take some time. Now, here we need to choose a region. So, I suggest we should choose US East. It may be far from your location, but still choose the US East because it has the maximum number of services available. At the time of recording, it has around 60 service, free service that we can use. So, we select the US East and create account. It will take some discreting of our account and it will take some time for that. Uh, our, our account has been created and click continue. Now go to the trial account. And here we will, let's go to overview before that let's check the trial and how many services are entitled it is 60 i shall explain those services at later stage uh, in our session but uh, there are 60 services available that i can use or i can bind in my now let me go inside and we will see our cloud foundry is created and uh, this is the cloud foundry uh, url and we have an org and dev a uh, space is dev i can create multiple space but uh, since it's a trial account we should restrict to one space and there is no application deployed yet we shall deploy our application at later Point. So that's it. We have successfully. So that's it. We have successfully created our Cloud Foundry account. Now we need to install CF CLI. 
a command line interface to connect with Cloud Foundry. For that, let's go through this link and how to install the CFCLI in different environment like Linux or macOS is mentioned here. And for Windows, we need to go to this particular link and download the zip file and install in your machine. And we may need to set up the environment variable also. Since I am using Mac, so let me install the CFCLI. And I am taking the CLI at 7, the version 7. Go to my terminal and install it. Brew install command. It is downloading and has been installed successfully. Since I have already installed CFCLI once in my system, so it is taking less time to install without any issue. Now let's check whether CF is installed and CF help. I can see all these uh, help options. So CF CLI command line interface is perfectly installed. Now it's time to connect with our Cloud Foundry instance. So for that, let me go here and I need to first let me check whether I think I should not connect it. I may be, okay. uh, first let me log out because I may be connected with other instance also. So, and now I give CF login minus A and the URL. So it is connecting to our Cloud Foundry account. Now provide the email ID, the same email ID with which I registered the trial account and the password. And we are connected to our Cloud Foundry. If you see here, this is the same org and the same space. In Cloud Foundry, we have org, within org, we have space. Where, and in the space, we shall deploy our applications. So we have installed the Cloud Foundry CF CLI and we are able to connect our Cloud Foundry account from the CF CLI. In our next session, we shall develop a Spring Boot application and we shall push this application into our Cloud Foundry. So thank you. Thanks for your time. Please like, share and subscribe and we shall meet in the next session. Thank you.